All right, Night Side MMA back again with Fight Night. This time in the featherweight division, Giga Chikaze versus Cub Swanson. Mm -hmm. Man, I'm a fan of both of these two. Yeah, huge fan of Cub. Yeah. And huge fan of uh, Giga, especially after like his last couple fights. He yeah. like, definitely made a fan out of me. Yeah, definitely. And Cub, like, you can't not like Cub. He's the swing and bang yeah. of the featherweight division. He's, he's the point, point the point the toe at the line yep. and just bang it out. But he's just so fucking tight. He's uh, so cool. Yeah, man. And when he so did cool. the, they're both they're both living so yeah, cow. Like. When he did the dog face video, spot on. Spot on. Spot on. <laughs> dog face in so dog well. fights. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I think before like well like when this fight got announced, we were talking about it. It's like Cup Cup kinda has this reputation for taking like hype trains and just completely derailing them in the most yeah. devastating way possible. Yeah, like Chrome Gracie. Yeah. He, he just, looks so good. And he just puts a beating on you. Like, if you're an up-and-comer. Yeah, he's just like, let me, yeah. like, devastate let you. Let me devastate you and all your confidence in your career <laughs> and make it feel like this was the wrong choice for you. And then in my next fights, not do that well. <laughs> Honestly, we haven't seen Chrome since. No. So, dude. And then Korean Superboy, oh, man. Yeah, beat that the, beat the brakes out of him. And we got to talk about Giga. He has such a he has a very good record in kickboxing. Yeah. So you know, coming in, but it's kind of weird because I feel like there's a mixed bag when it comes to like kickboxers moving to MMA. Yeah, it's either they're like very adept at keeping it on the because like I think kickboxers who do good in MMA, it's because once they decide to make that transition, they stop working on their striking altogether and work on takedown defense right like those are the good ones right but the ones that don't work on the takedown defense and just believe they could just rely on their hands right. usually don't do well and giga has proven time and time and again that he can go out there with some of the best and he just puts the yeah. freaking lights out it's just crazy like he's so long but he's able to close distance and get his strikes out so fast yeah it's like like no tell like i don't get yeah it's like he's He's, like, spamming the controller. Yes. And just, like, throwing everything he can. And it's just so fast when he throws. I love Giga, but yeah. his name sounds like a Digimon. But anyways... <laughs> Chikaze evolves to... <laughs> Giga, Giga Chikaze! Chikaze. <laughs> <laughs> He's so fucking dope, dude. <laughs> like, seriously, like, we have to talk about this fight because, you know, right... Off the bat, right when the bell starts, he utilizes those yeah. kicks. He doesn't even, yeah, like, literally right when the bell goes, he kicks right away. Yeah. Like, there's no feeling out period. Mm -mm. It's like, he understands his distance immediately. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. And he doesn't really, like, he, the cool part about Giga is that he has no tell when he sends out no, his No, there is no telegraphing at all. I was trying to, like, especially during the slow-mos... I was, like, trying to stare at his shoulder to see if there was any twitch mm -hmm. before he would send out his hook, which is absurdly fast. Yeah. Like, you shouldn't be able to whip it as fast as he can, especially being as long as he is, but he can. So I was trying to, like, look at his hips and look at his um, shoulder to see if there's any twitches or tells, and there really isn't. Yeah. Which is scary, because, like, when he's striking you, he's at a distance where I don't think anyone in the division has the reach to also touch him. Right, because he's long. Like, he's so long. Yeah. Yeah. And yo, like that fight was, it's so quick. Yeah, it was, it so was quick, quick. But this is one of those things where he placed it perfectly. The perfect spot. Like when you, that liver kick, in fact, it wouldn't have landed as clean if like he wasn't as long as he is. Right. Because like it just, it would have missed altogether. Right. And like the fact that he hit it kind of with the tip of his foot right in the liver, like he dug it in. Right where, like, Cub's guard was not, because Cub's guard was kind of high. I think he was expecting a head kick. Right, right, right. Because he was getting kicked in the head earlier. It was just in the perfect spot. And, like, It yeah. was just such a good combo, because it was, like, he... Because the combo was left kick, left hook, yeah. left kick. And it just was the perfect shot. And let's be yeah. real, Cub is a freaking warrior, no, man. he, like, goes through that shit. Like, he, he's been known to just weather almost anything. But that's the thing about, like body shots it's like no matter how tough you are if it lands right it gets it shuts you. down everything and the way he set it up was perfect so he kept cubs uh right side busy but he kept it very busy high so i think cub was really expecting another strike to his head 
Right. And so he kept his guard super high, and he just fit the kick right in there and yeah. just put him down. Yeah, so... And it's like, when you get hit in the body, it's like... I don't know how to describe it. It's like, you can't use anything in your body when you get hit in the body. It's it, the off switch. Yeah, it like literally will lock up your arms, it'll lock up your breathing, and like that's why he had to hit the ground immediately. Like It, it literally takes away the, your ability to do anything. Move, breathe block anything so you know it's not like he went down like a little sissy that's like no. not how it is at all like because like, cub yeah, is the man cub's the fucking man and giga just i think now that he's put on these crazy performances mm -hmm. the guy deserves top 10 For we sure. can't deny him yeah i say sadiq yusuf yeah exactly he, he just lost to um arnold allen mm -hmm. by united's decision so it's not like he was you know put out mm -hmm. you know he he doesn't need like a medical suspension or anything like that. He wasn't finished, yeah. you know. So and then Sadiq himself very dangerous. Yeah. So and uh, ranked number ten. So yeah. So I think that would be a good test for him. Yeah, man, fucking Giga. Yeah, fucking Giga. Digimon. Digital monsters. TKO Giga Chikaze. I'm here with the winner, Giga Chikatze, with the Giga kick to finish things off.